Next complaint that I hear quite often in the industry is uh, handlebars, okay? So, you know, it's one thing to get, you know, an awesome, you know, designed machine in terms of the mechanics, the motors, the plate, all that kind of stuff. That's definitely, you know, a priority, okay? But what's secondary to that is getting a machine with the right handlebars that, first of all, are not going to shake you know, too profusely and have too much resonance in the actual frame that's going to cause your fingers to turn white, which can sometimes happen to people after some period of time of using it. Um, that's, that's number one. Uh, but also, you want to make sure that they're laid out well. So you have to know how you're using the machine, how you want to use it, and what your health goals are. If you're trying to mainly flush your lymphatic system and get up in all the way into your upper body, you've got to lean back on your heels, which means you have to straighten your arms out more. And you have to have enough space um, where you can actually comfortably lean back. You don't want to have to stand too close because the handlebars are, you know, don't give you enough reach, okay? So you want to be able to straighten out your arms, but you also don't want to have to straighten them way too far out. Also, if you have short arms, there's all these variables. So, so we'll have to actually even ask our customers for their dimensions, um, how tall they are, their stance, how long their arms are. Uh, now let's say you're doing more dynamic exercises, we have like a lot of physical therapists, other practitioners like that, who are doing a lot of squats on the machines, all sorts of different movements like that. When you're squatting, you want to make sure you have the right kind of bars to pull yourself up easily after a while when you get fatigued. You don't have to have some really strange grip on the, on the, bar, on the frame you know, as you're trying to get back up or trying to do some other sort of dynamic exercise. So we know the machines that generally customers are happiest about. Uh, for doing dynamic exercises or just static sorts of postures or holds. Um, so there's really a lot. There's some of those other bars that go around the sides of you. Um, these can, again, be good for certain types of exercises or movements and not really that good for other ones. Um, so a lot of people are complaining because they were sold into something. They weren't complaining from us, by the way, but they call me and then basically say, you know what, uh, I need to get a different machine because I'm trying to do this exercise, I'm trying to do this. And this, the, the way that the frame is laid out and handlebars is not working for me. So we always, always want to make sure that we get you the right machine, you know, with the great components, but also the right layout frames for your needs. Give me a call if you have any questions.